so I have made a video about this before. Here's an update. Shout out to the Shade Room. The other day they posted the following. So first of all, your girl Nia Lee had posted something about the Love and Hip Hop New York Season 9 Reunion Part 2 show that aired last Monday. What was that? March 18th of 2019, right? Your girl Nia Lee had talked about the show on Instagram, you know, and basically your girl Nia Lee had took a swipe at Mariah Lynn and whatnot. And what she said at the end of her post was, you do you and I'll continue to do me hashtag boop. Drop a hashtag boop below for the bird with some laughing crying emojis in. Cash Doll chimed in and said boop, clowning Mariah Lynn. So then my boot thing Mariah Lynn said to somebody named Flyboy Life, birds of a feather flock together with a couple of mallard duck emojis. And Nia Lee said, Mariah Lynn, real B words hold each other down. You're in a flock with birds, ugly. So Cash Doll went on to say, it was a crowd participation, forehead slapping emoji. I was just doing what Naya said in the caption, laughing crying emoji, dang shade room gone. And then Mariah Lynn said at Cash Doll, girl, you need to focus on that confused A word crowd. Your stage presence is weak, how? Cash Doll, bitch, don't blame the shade room. You knew what you was doing, and honestly, it's pretty lame because I supported you. And without even knowing you, but there's always room for more clowns in the circus, sis, with a, I guess, like a circus emoji. And I, I don't even know what that other emoji is. I, I don't know why people post so many emoji shots of Mariah Lynn. So somebody named YSL.ICDoll said, Mariah Lynn, you can't book a stage. So I wouldn't say yours is much better with a ghastly face emoji. Mariah Lynn said to the YSL person, I headline all my shows and they all sell out. Are you dumb? I just sold out 5,000 people in Oakland, California with a zip lips emoji. Now, Mariah Lynn is from New Jersey. So 3,000 miles away in Oakland, she sold out 5,000 people. Somebody named Jeju underscore said Mariah Lynn laughing, laughing my A off. Sus, you big mad. So Mariah Lynn said to that person, not at all, just disappointed. So Mariah Lynn was cool with Cash Doll, but Cash Doll is apparently a whole heifer. I didn't know that she was that type of person. Now I love me some Keisha. Keisha, listen, Keisha Cash Doll is fine as hell. She could wrap her booty off and <laughs> sweet lord. That means she can really rap because that's a that's a whole lot of booty wrap off your dick. And she's fine as hell. And I'm a huge fan of Cash Dolls so about his Big as a booty. I mean, that Ice Me Out song, I couldn't understand what she was saying at first, but I went to Genius.com and, you know, I figured it out. So she's saying Ice Me Out. I thought she was saying Ice Me Out. Ice Me Out. Ice Me Out. Like, I thought it was like a cat. Like, if somebody accidentally steps on the cat's tail, says Ice Me Out. Or I, I didn't know. Like, I was trying to figure it out. And the point is this, man. Shout out to Cash Doll and that song Ice Me Out. You know, I left a comment on that video. If y'all see the video, make sure you thumbs up my comment and leave a comment to me on there. But, you know, Cash Doll is, is an amazing lady. I mean, she can rap and she's fine as hell. So, I'm, of course, I'm a fan. But Mariah Lynn is my favorite female rapper of the new school female rappers. I told you before, you know, at the end of the day, it's Little Kim and Lauren Hill. As far as the legends go, but Mar Mariah Lynn is the leader of the new school to me. But, I mean, Cash Doll has talent. I don't know what's going to take to make her the star that she deserves to be, but I told y'all before, man, the the people that you really need to look out for as far as female rappers are concerned. Remember, I'm the dude who told you back in 2015 that Cardi B, the stripper mixtape chick, was about to be this huge star. I don't remember anybody else saying that. If they were, shout out to you. But I was like, man, Cardi B is going to be huge. I'm like, y'all don't understand. This girl's a star. I believe in her. She's loyal. I got my DJ Khaled on. DJ Khaled needs to eat a salad. But anyways, I was trying to tell you, I'm like, this girl Cardi B is, is she's the one to watch out for. Now I'm telling y'all, and I'm telling y'all for a minute, I'm going to name four names. Shout out to Cash Doll, but I'm going to name four other names, okay? Y'all need to be looking out for Mariah Lynn, Dream Doll, Megan Thee Stallion, and Iggy Azalea. 
she's not done so I'm gonna tell you y'all keep sleeping on that that chick from Australia y'all keep sleeping if you want you, you're gonna be woke up by by an earthquake when that hit drops it's gonna be Hiroshima you're gonna be like oh shoot Iggy has a smash that's what I'm trying to tell y'all right now to prepare for it it's Iggy Megan Mariah and dream period y'all paying attention to the city girls everybody's talking about cast all try to tell you Megan Mariah dream and Iggy all right now I be knowing what I'm talking about all right let me know what y'all think about it below man whose side are you on Cash's or Mariah's and why I love you cast all but you are out of pocket all right what did Mariah do to you nothing does she have respect for you? She had love for you. And y'all female rappers need to stick together. Because a lot of y'all fine as hell and got a whole bunch of talent. A whole bunch of booty. And, and y'all need to be rubbing the booties together for good luck. Instead of trying to pop them. Alright y'all. Let me know what y'all think about it below. Me Magazine on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and MeWe. Me Magazine blog on Instagram. Thumbs up, comment, subscribe, notify. Let me know what you think about my cutie pies, Mariah and Cash and Naya. Share this video on social media, Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus, two cans with a string in the middle telepathically. That way everybody in Mama 2 knows that my girl Cash and my girl Mariah, I guess, don't like each other. And that sucks to me because I think they're both dope. They both look good. And I wanted a collaboration to come out of this. But that's possibly not going to happen, at least for a couple years or something. Because I think that they'll get over this. Because they I, see, talent is going to recognize talent at some point. They're going to have to give each other props. They'll bump into each other at some award show or something. They'll put their arm around each other, take a photo of each other, hopefully go back to the hotel and take a bite out of each other. If, it's, if I had any to say about it, you'd uh, But anyway, it's got to go. Me Magazine.